is just not fair. <laughs> it's just not fair. I just woke up. I was <laughs> I was planning to go to my doctor's office today and get back on my medication. I was <laughs> I need my medication. <laughs> Please, God, I need my medication back. I need to be allowed to go see my doctor. I need to be allowed to get back on my drugs. I need my Latuda back. I need my Zoloft back. I need my medication back. And I can't get it because every time I go to get it, they come at me with something else that they need. Today was supposed to be my day. I was supposed to be able to go and get this and start feeling better. But no, I woke up to Virgie demanding money from me. Money that he knows I don't have. Once again, just like two days ago when I woke up and they were demanding money that I don't have. Never have, never have. They know they're always demanding money that I never have to give them. They never gave me any money. How am I supposed to give them back money that they never fucking gave me? They never gave me anything. They never gave me anything. Anything. But they want it back. They want it back. They're demanding it back. Constantly demanding it back. <laughs> and I have to pay him or it'll never end. <laughs> I have to hurt myself so that it'll stop. Because <laughs> I'm never going to have any money to pay anybody. <laughs> Not ever. I am a worthless bitch that is never going to have the kind of money that they are demanding from me. And the only thing worth more than money is blood and pain. So instead of getting to go and get on my medication today, I have to go find a way to hurt myself badly enough that my stalker will earn enough money off of it that he will be pleased for a day and allow me to maybe get my medication next month. <laughs> maybe I might be allowed next month. <laughs> But only if I can hurt myself badly enough today to satisfy them. <laughs> I'm never going to be able to. I'll never be able to hurt enough for them and I'll never have the money and I'll never have anybody that cares. <laughs> they know I don't have any money and I wake up and they're demanding money from me and <laughs> I know I don't have any. <laughs> I just wanted my medication back. <laughs> I just wanted <laughs> to feel better. <laughs> I just wanted to feel better and now I have to hurt myself just so they'll leave me alone. <laughs> and then tomorrow I'll have to do it again and to the day after that I'll have to do it again and I'll have to keep amputating parts of my body until there's nothing left and somebody finally investigates why it's happening <laughs> if I hurt myself bad enough the police will investigate that's the only hope that I have for this to ever end, is that I hurt myself so badly, it forces the police to investigate it. And then they'll ask why I'm supposedly, uh, why do I owe this money? Why are they demanding this money? Why are they hassling for me this money? Why are they terrorizing me for this money? And finally, somebody will look into it and understand that I never should have been expected to give them any money when they've been earning money off of hurting me for, for years. They earned money. They earn thousands of dollars a night doing this to me and then they demand money from me and they know I don't have any. They know I, they know I don't have anything. I don't even have any furniture in the place where I live. <laughs> and all I wanted today was to get back on my medication. <laughs> I really wanted 
need to help myself today. I really wanted to help myself. Why did they have to start harassing me today? Why did they have to come back with their threats and demands of money today? Why couldn't they let me get help? <laughs> Why couldn't they just let me get my medication back? <laughs> Ha 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 ha!